Hello everyone! Welcome back to Asclepian Gaming. I'm Asclepian Wisdom and today we're gonna do our random Sunday gaming of Balram. So this was actually suggested to me by a friend. I got this through Steam. I purchased it with my own money. I'm not cool enough yet to get sponsorships, but so what we got here is it looks like a survival based game, maybe some crafting. I'm not really sure. Anyway, remember guys, if you like what I do, hit the subscribe button, hit that little bell next to it if you want to be alerted to new videos. And without further ado, let's get started. I was only a child when we fled the kingdom and took refuge in Darkwood. A lot has happened in the past 20 years while we've been living here. Everyone has a part in the life of the village. We have become a real community. Now that I have grown up, it's time for me to decide what part I will play. People say the woods protect us from the filthy world that Balram has become. They forget that the place we live in once was a place of horrors. The dark history of the forest keeps trouble outside. The stories about why we had to hide in the woods each seem different. I don't know who to believe. Every time I ask Grandpa about the past, he changes the subject. One thing is for sure, something horrible happened. Maybe one day I will know the truth. I know that Grandpa was an apprentice of a wizard when he was younger, but rarely uses magic nowadays. He often tells me that I should practice magic and embrace my supposed abilities, but I'm not sure what I want to do. I've been taking lessons in alchemy and the arcane from Brown and Leonard. In my free time, I usually, please select option. <laughs> uh, in my free time, I probably would help on a farm. I'm actually from a smart, smart, Aren't you dear? I'm from a small farming community, so I'm actually, I really like planting and doing things. I'm really sad because where I currently live, I, um, I battle random bouts of hail in storms. So I get really excited because I'm like, woohoo, I get some free water up in here for my plants. And then all of a sudden it just turns into like a hail storm. Good band, by the way, if you don't know anything, if you're into rock. Uh, check out Hailstorm. Anyway, not relevant to the story, but anyway, hail will just start coming down from like freaking nowhere. And it could be anything from like pea sized to like golf ball sized. And last year it destroyed my herb garden. So um, my herbs no longer have a permanent home outside. I have put them into little pots because I am absolutely paranoid that I'm gonna lose them if they stay that way. So I, yeah, anyway, that was a really long story for this intro. Yeah, continuing on. And oftentimes I practice. Ooh, sword play, spell casting, or archery. Okay, so I've actually done archery in real life. I'm not that good at it unless I warm up. And I'm really good with swords. But I really like swords the most. Specifically, I love dual wielding with two short swords. It's really fun. Heavy swords are kind of a pain in the ass. I have mad respect for people who can do that. I try and help everywhere I can, but I'm more eager to help out. Da 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 da. Let's see. Smelting. I feel like these are going to contribute to stuff I need for things. Which is fine, because so far I'm happy with this. Uh, let's see. Smelting will be important. Hunting will provide food. Oh, shoot. I hadn't even noticed you could hover over these. You got... <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Farming. Uh, with each level, the skill, blah, blah, blah. So that's one way of doing... Uh, so I can get food through farming. So maybe smelting would be helpful for, like, better armor and stuff. I'm not very good at potion brewing. Because the work they do interests me. Life is much easier when I was younger. Now my head is filled with questions and doubt. Oh, interesting. Okay. Do I do I pick one? Pet heal. Stun with my mad fists of epicness. Deep wounds. We cut deep. Strong strike and atta attack. Oh, good. I'm glad I can attack things as a starting ability. 
Alright, so we're gonna need at least one of each. And then, uh, Vitality. Hmm. More health is nice. More strength is nice. Melee hit, uh, mana. Spell damage, uh, boop. Okay, we're gonna be kind of tanky. Okay, choose one extra starting supply. Speed potion, magical seeds. Interesting, nightmare berries. For spells, lovely. Phoenix egg. So do we just eat the egg? We don't get to like hatch a phoenix or anything, you know. Hatch the phoenix first, get more eggs later. Ugh. The shield of Odysseus. Or sometimes a tall vase is carved into these. Okay, so do I want more money? Do I want healing potions? Or I want mystery seeds. <laughs> <laughs> Magical seeds! I'm just curious. Okay. Panic ring. 7% dodge if you're like low. Leech ring. Tap into the fading soul of a fallen enemy. I like that one. I like the leech ring. Raptor ring. Critical melee attacks recover a small amount of health. Oh, that's actually kind of nice too. Critical spell attacks recover a small amount of mana. Or the phoenix ring enables you to resurrect your pet without a phoenix egg. Oh. Power of a ring, a small cooldown effect will be... Oh, okay. Oh, uh, dang. Shoots and ladders. Kind of want that. But, like, I also love my pet, so, like, my companion might need me. But, fuck it. I'm gonna do that. Continue! Oh, god. Difficulty. Novice? I'm new. Well, normal, easy. Oh, hunger and thirst decrease at normal rate. Blah blah blah. Hunger and thirst decrease at a slow rate. I'm gonna be a cheap bastard and I'm gonna go novice. Ha ha! Cause I'm a dick. What's oh, a dragon? Dragon, release the dragon! I could not locate my brothers. The mage's guild has to figure out something. <laughs> Destroying the remains is beyond our powers. <laughs> I don't know why I chose really bad voice acting for this, but it just felt appropriate. Oh, I missed last line. My bad. It's raining heavily tonight as we walk back from the hunt with Fox. I have a strange feeling, and I can see that Fox is worried too. We separate at the edge of the forest. As I approach our home, I smell smoke and can see lightning shining through the woods. Something bad has happened. Okay, so I don't have to build from scratch. I just kind of get something. That's cool. Oh god. Oh god. Oh, god. Good thing I don't need glasses yet. Hold down the left mouse button or use the WASD keys on your keyboard. Or right click. Pressing two direction keys at the same time will result in a diagonal movement. To wait a turn, press space key or click on the turn button on the far left of the. Oh, quick slots. Far left. Aha! It doesn't actually show up until you hover over it. That's cool, okay. <clears throat> Moving on. C opens up your character panel and hover through the skills and indicators to get more crap. You can <laughs> reconfigure your keys anytime. Oh, so it's got like... Ah! I'm reminded of Warcraft and everything. Got all my hotkeys. Good thing I got a gaming mouse. I love that shit. It's nice having the buttons on the side. Okay, info buttons, blah blah blah. Green arrow indicates that the object is usable. Walk to the object and left click it to use it. Red indicates that it is attackable. <laughs> if it's half and half, indicates it's usable and attackable. <laughs> Attack it, then use it. It's a way of life. <laughs> Shift and click if it's attack. Loot bag is gold. Silver sword indicates that the enemy is attackable, but something prevents the action. The red one indicates that the enemy is attackable and all requirements are met. A question mark indicates that you are able to talk to the person. Ew. This is interesting. <laughs> okay, how do I get rid of Oh, there it is. Boop. 
A green cursor indicates that the object beneath it is interactable. When the cursor turns green while hovering on a chest or a barrel, it indicates that there's something inside. Oh, gee, thanks. Jax is your pet. He loyally awaits your every command. When you select a pet ability for him to use, he will use the selected ability during the next turn if all the requirements are met for the given ability. Just like Jax, left click on him or press U. To access the commands menu, right click on him or click on the pet button on the lower end of the screen. Pet button! Cool, cool. What do you want to do? What do you want to do? What do you want to do? Just follow me. Wee -oo -wee. <laughs> There's nothing. It's too far away. Can we run? Oh god. Over the years, I became familiar with one of the wildlife. Frogs, rats, and some of the large larvae are not aggressive, but every other animal will try to eat me. Brown told me to pick up every plant I see, so I can experiment with them on the alchemy table. There are a number of berry bushes growing here. Some of the berries have powerful medicinal effects. Oh, that's right, because I also have a uh, weird crap. I guess this... Oh, sweet baby Jesus! Okay... Weird. Why did I... What did that thing do to me? Can I not go through the bushes? I really have to... <laughs> this reminds me so much of these old school games I used to play. Okay, so even though there's more berries on the way, oh god. Okay, I didn't get stung. That's nice. How refreshing. Okay. This is... Oh, okay. Oh god, it reminds me so much of D&D. It's like, ow! Ow! What the shit sticks? Okay, brown bush is evil. Fuck you, brown bush. <laughs> okay, this is apparently what I have on my person. What is this? Flower? Wait, why did I not take it? Can I take it? That's what I did last time, and it got all weird on me. Anyway... <laughs> Whatever. Game. Oh, can I not get to all that crap? Yeah, there we go. Boom. More flour. We're gonna make some bread and stuff. What is this? Millstone. Ripe wheat in the millstone. That millstone looks like it's seen better days. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Death cap. Mmm, that sounds exciting. Life herbs sound a little bit more <laughs> peaceful. Okay, brown bushes are evil. These are our berry bushes, rose hips. Good to know. Okay, what else can we click on? Anything over here? Can I gather water? I have no reason to climb down there. Uh, that wasn't my plan, but okay. This is a really big town. I was expecting, like, having to be by myself. And, like, I wonder how many of those can stack. We're just gonna gather a fuck ton of flour. It's probably not even our flour. I probably shouldn't be touching this, but <laughs> who knows? Can we run? Shift is pressed. <laughs> you cannot run. Just a <laughs> why not? Anything in here? Uh, empty glass, why not? Let's just steal people's stuff. That's what I feel like so far that we've done. Life plant. This seems important. Let's gather all the things. Can I... Life plant seeds added to my inventory. Oh, this is cute. Where's my house again? Is it the one that's over here? Is that my house? The field is... Well hydrated. Ugh. How do I get wood? What is wrong with this thing? How do you get into the field though if it's like if if they repair it? I'm gonna come to this tree. It looks like I can do things. Oh. <laughs> Where did I just whip? I'm so confused. Where did I just whip this axe out of? 
Like, I literally just... Like, what the fuck? Ew. Delantium ore. Oh, there's, like, different tabs for different supplies. That's kind of cool. Iron ore. I'm just stealing from people. Hi, hopefully we're, like, a village of sharing and is caring, because I'm totally stealing your shit. <laughs> ah! I am not very good at these controls. Yet. Yet. Just you watch life. Sun berries. That helps the power of the sun. Oh god. Okay, does... Wait, what? So I thought there was supposed to be like some kind of hunger bar. What the hell? Loose cloth belt and a spider eye. Mmm. Yummy. The fuck? How did I get that out of some dirt? I'm a little confused. Cut leaf berry. We only know that's a life plant thing. How am I supposed to get in here if I repair all this nonsense? I don't even know. Whatever. Whatever. We'll, we'll figure it out. Can I click on any other crap? Where are you going, sir? Come. Come hither. Click on this crap. Chop down the weird nasty tree. This one too. Just watch out for the bush of bullshit. And somebody will start calling it. Because <laughs> that's what that thing feels like. I can't even get there. How do I... Uh, don't walk into the bush of evil! How do I whack down the weeds? Can I... Can I attack them? No. No, I cannot. Useless! What is this? That looks important. Can you interact with it? My skill is too low. What the hell does that mean? Usually there are old letters or documents inside these white bags. Okay, cool. Can I even get to it? Ooh, can I read it? Wait. Wait, what? Inventory. I is always inventory. There's gotta be a thing. Right click to read. One turn. Oh good. What the fuck? <laughs> there we go. Jesus. No wonder I haven't been able to find the herbs. I was looking in the wrong place, or to be more specific, wrong time. A number of plants are only visible at night. I think I'm going to lose a lot of sleep in the coming days. Ooh. Nighttime. Wait, is there a time progression that I'm not seeing on here? Some Somewhere? Oh, right, you're following me. I don't know why I clicked that. Shift is pressed. It doesn't actually- oh god. <laughs> Shift doesn't really do anything exciting. Oh god, it's a graveyard. Spooky. Combat in Balram is turn-based. To attack an enemy, you have to at least have at least one ability selected in the quick slot bar. Uh, what? <laughs> to attack it. Wait, what? To select an ability, right-click on its icon or press the appropriate number on your keyboard. Selected melee abilities can be used with a left-click on the targeted enemy. Selected range abilities can be used with a right-click on the targeted enemy. Good to know. To target an enemy, simply left-click on it and its health, and mana bar will turn silver, indicating that it has been targeted. Special combat effects play an important role in the game, so always check the effects on you and your target's combat effects. Affecting you will appear in the top right corner of the screen. Effects affecting your enemies will appear below their health bar. Wait. Oh, I'm about to fight somebody. Where the hell did those big ass things come from? Dope. We're gonna fight. that one. I feel like I'm gonna die. Oh god, I did die! <laughs> oh my god, what just happened? I died. Wait, I didn't even say- oh god, sweet baby Jesus. <laughs> uh... Lame. 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 
that was on easy mode too. Now I feel super duper lame. Ah, uh, I, I need to save the game, so I don't have to do this all again. <laughs> oh shoot. I was not ready for three enemies against one. That was bullshit. <laughs> this is such a weird game. I don't even know how I feel about it, to be honest. I love that, like... So the weather icon appears up in here. I don't see where it tracks the time, though. Ah, coffee is life. But, uh, whatever. Okay, so don't go digging over here. <laughs> that was a bad idea. That was a very bad idea. <laughs> Almost grown corn. Grown melon. Can we touch the grown melon? Harvest! Oh, can I plant here? Can can I 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 like don't know if I can plant there. Oh god. Hello lightning. This this is manure. Manure. Shovel and manure. Okay. Inventory. We have a seed. Can we put the seed in here? Oh we can. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Young magical chest. Wait, what? What? Haha, <laughs> so cool. <laughs> I'm easily entertained. Okay. Ow, ah, to you too. Uh, corn seeds. Good to know. Melon seeds. Good to know. I like that you can separate the inv how it separates the inventory. That's actually kind of neat. I appreciate that, actually. Wheat seeds. Good to know. <laughs> what do I keep saying? Good to know. I don't know. What can we do here? Cauldron. Ooh. Okay. This is actually way more involved than I was expecting. <clears throat> if I'm being honest. Oh, we got dookie! Good, I need dookie. I need to put manure in there. Can we keep putting manure in there? It's perfect. Absolutely perfect. Ah, woo! Burnt door. What the hell happened in this town that half this crap is all burnt down? Three wood or three pine wood and some nails. How do we make some nails? Let's talk to you. Grandpa! Hey, Grandpa! I can thank Grandpa for so much. He took me in while my parents died and brought me up. And brought me up. I don't know why I said it that way. Grandpa knows a little bit about everything. A true drack of all trades. He once told me that someone taught him about magic a long time ago, but whenever I ask about it, he quickly changes the subject. Grandpa never told me a lot about my parents, and he says that it's best for me not to know about them. People somehow seem distant towards him. What happened here, Grandpa? Are you alright? Or, here's the meat I've collected, Grandpa. I was hoping for more, but this will be enough for us, and I can give some to Edmund and Winnie. What happened? I'm alright, son, but look at our home. The whole house nearly burnt down. Thank the gods I could stop the fire from burning up everything. You never come late when you were out hunting. This kept me from going to sleep. I think we can say that you being late saved my life and our home. At least what is left of it. I would have been my last resting place. How could have this happened? <laughs> my boy, I have no idea how this could have happened. I put the candles out so they couldn't have caused the fire. The fire started far away from the torch, so there is nothing else I can think of. I'm old, but I can still cast a powerful freeze spell. It was barely enough to stop the flames. I'm so glad that you're alright, Grandpa. The house can be repaired, but I don't know what I would do without you. You're like a father to me. Don't worry, son, I'm here to stay. Enough about me, I'm fine. But our neighbors disappeared. Uh-oh. <laughs> Pack, Frida, and their little girl, Audie, are missing. Not Audie! Their house burnt down to the ground. This can't be a coincidence. People are worried that they might be next. What can we do? Ew! Men are already out searching for them. As for the fire, Arlo suspects it might be the torches. That's really embarrassing for Aaron, since he made them. You don't messed up, A.A. Ron, even on your name. But as I said, the fire at our home didn't start because of a bad torch. I don't know, son, but something is really wrong. You should go and talk to Peck and Frida's neighbors, Cardu and Thurza. 
What a straw name, Thurza. They might have seen or heard something before you take this. Before you go, take this. That's what he said. There we go. Your parents gave it to me. They told me that I should give it to you when you need protection. I think the time has come. It will take you to a place where no one can find you. Build a house there. Oh, see, I knew it. I knew I was going to have to be on my own soon. <laughs> and whenever you feel that your life's in danger, use the rune. Please, my boy, don't ask questions. You won't tell me anything about my parents. Fine. Well, not ask questions. But I will not leave you, Grandpa. It is almost dawn, and even the smoke is gone. I'll be fine. That poor little girl, Adi. Not Adi! How could they just disappear? No bodies were found. I think it's best if you look into it, son. Trust me. I'll be fine. All right, I'll be back there. <laughs> End. <laughs> and scene. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, I got experience for talking to Grandpa. You will need nails, wood, and a decent door handle. Wood you can find everywhere, but a door handle and some sturdy nails need to be made by a blacksmith. Go to Aaron. He will sell you the things you need. Also, you could visit your carpenter, Master Jones. He might help you with more delicate jobs. It's been 20 years, Grandpa! <laughs> Alright, anyway. Blah, blah, blah. Okay, cool. Cool, 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 cool. What's in here? This looks important. What did Grandpa give me? Actually. I'm genuinely curious. He was supposed to give me something. This thing? Animal taming trap. Nope. Oh god. Wait, where'd I get all this crap from? I have a splint? Oh god. A shovel. Good to know. Maps. This is not the proper map for the area. <laughs> okay. Wow. This is really big. Oh, I can put the description in? Cool. That's kind of neat. So you can mark the map. That's different. Okay. Boop. This is a uh, home base. No, wait. Grandpa. Ender. <laughs> oh god, it really does actually mark it. Cool, 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 cool. Safe place rune. Grandpa's lucky trinket. That's a weird ass looking trinket, Grandpa. Oh wait, I'm supposed to take stuff from this thing. Alright, so arrows. That looks important. Okay, so 64 is a pile. More splints. That seems important. Simple torches. Those seem important. And one strange thaler. Oh. I could have right clicked to hurry up and take everything. That's funny. I feel stupid. <laughs> speed potions. Hell yeah. Who doesn't ever want speed potions? It's a bag. Let's take some stuff. Why didn't I have to dust this note off? See, I have to dust this note off. I don't get the dusting of the notes. The two mighty adventures. Although Dudley is not so mighty. One treasure so far, which we've collected when exploring the ruins. A strange ring, an old coin, a short sword, in great condition. A weird looking potion with larva in it. Mmm. Gross. We had this one near our house between the rock, so Grandpa won't find it. Ooh, I'm guessing it's this! Dudley. Damn Dudley. Why is my character making weird noises? So this is definitely a, uh... Kind of like slow and steady gaming experience that you'll run into is my guess <laughs> based off of everything i've done uh transform into a larva potion that's gross who would want that Do, does my equipment have like durability issues or are we just like free for all whatever the hell's 
Because I feel like... Combat. Not again. Do I have to fight somebody? It's not my turn. Well, where's the freaking thing I was supposed to be fighting? Whatever. <laughs> I'm not fighting nobody. I'll do what I want. That looks like I could do things on here. Uh, where's the food section? This one. Boop. That's what I did. Oh, so it's like one of those automatic ones. Okay, cool. Cool, 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 cool. So there's going to be a lot of... Did it just fling the flower into my inventory? That's kind of funny. So there's going to be a lot of crafting and gathering, you guys, in this game, obviously. And apparently repairing crap. I don't know when that's... We're going to, like, escape off into the world. Oh, there's the biggest barris. <laughs> That's a huge bear. Uh, you can do uh, WASD for moving, or you can just click and hold. And you'll just kind of go in a direction, so that's another thing. Um, for if you're interested into it. I don't know where this magical alchemy bench is that they kind of gooseberries. Oh my god. All I can think of is the witcher. You smell like lilacs and gooseberries. Which, by the way, is actually a pretty pleasant smell, if you haven't smelled it before. <laughs> Why is there a random lock pick in this? In the log? I don't want to know. I, uh, it's fine. This is fine. Who the hell is this? Let's go to this random chick in our field. You can't even walk over the- oh god. You can't even walk over the field plots. That's so annoying. It's like a maze. Ida owns the largest farm in the woods. Hey, you're the one that I chose. I was like, hey, what's up? I want to enrich my knowledge in farming. Wait, how do I know how much money I have? Inventory. <laughs> 143 thaler. That's our, that's our monies. Ida, I ain't paying you shit. I'm gonna plant the plants the way I know how to plant the plants. Where are you going, woman? I was talking to you. Rude. How rude. <laughs> Boop. Oh, God. What the heck? Tick fang and... It... Those are huge-ass ticks. If <laughs> it's gonna be that big... Good Lord. Seriously, how do we get rid of all this tall grass? Is that even an option at any point? Because, ugh, this is annoying. And the random run-ins with stuff are cracking me up. Wow, I am not good at this. Holy crap. Okay, we know not to go there, because we know it's hiding over there. And all that nonsense. Oh god. Poor Hugo. R.I.P. Hugo. Oh, there's like a cre- oh, who, What kind of- uh, Can you imagine living in a world where it's like... <laughs> just random pear just fell out of the tree. That's yummy. Can you imagine? Ugh. Gross. Who's this? Is that Ida? Okay, so this is the farmers. <laughs> you guys, I'm so bad at organizing my head in this. That's Grandpa. More farming. We need the blacksmith, according to what we just read. What is with all the fire? Oh, is that the house that burned down? Oh no, those are the torches. That just seems like a very bad design idea, you guys. That's a lot of fire. This town is huge! I don't know how to pick locks. Something is moving in my backpack. Is that its hint to, like, be like, here's your lockpicks? <laughs> Automatically used. I can't do that right now. No, I don't want to drop that. I want to use it! Help! Thief! No, wait! 
Wait, why is there creepy battle music? Did I get in trouble? I didn't mean to. Don't be angry. Don't be a bitch, whoever you are. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. He's angry at me. No, no, don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. Why is something moving in my backpack? Don't hurt me. I didn't mean to, okay? I'm just... I thought we were a sharing community. Don't be mad. Don't be mad. What the hell is moving in my backpack that I need to be worried about? How is this guy able to find me? I feel like I was out of his line of sight like ages ago. Oh, he gonna come through there. Oh, God. Don't kill me! I didn't mean to! Why is something moving in my backpack? I'm so creeped out by it. Does he stop following me so I can at least look? A hungry bug. A bug. Oh my god! What a What the hell? You guys, there's a bug in my inventory. Go away, dude! Oh god, I feel like I'm like. <laughs> I wasn't trying to steal! Don't kill me! Oh, thank god. He lost interest. Okay. So just run away from people for a while. Oh my god. How am I going to find the blacksmith in all of this? I mean, I have a map, but it's not a very good map. There's Dudley. Hey, Dudley. What up, brah? We're supposed to be friends according to these random notes I found. Yeah, experience points for this. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Who the f are all these people? Rice is a shady person. <laughs> Why are we talking to shady people? Who this? Edith. Hi, Edith. Mother's preparing the fields. God, this is gonna take forever. <laughs> Okay, so lessons learned. You can get creepy weird bugs in your shit. Oh, I hear a- Oh! Just the dude I was looking for. What up, friend? I'm dehydrated. How do I know I'm dehydrated? Hey, Ron. Arm nearly burnt down. Thanks. Tell me how to craft up his armor. Let's continue. Cool, 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 cool. How can I use the things? Oh. So you can basically ask them a bunch of things and... Okay, cool, 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 cool. <laughs> Durable hoe. <laughs> I feel like these will be important later when I need those things. Like, I know that I need. For sure. Cool. Awesome. So that's neat. So I'll have to smelt stuff and things like that. That's nice. Oh. Okay. How do I get undehydrated? Can I, like, eat something? Here's diseased plant. Yeah, I know you're... Oh, Jesus. I'm taking damage. <laughs> How do I drink stuff? <laughs> do you give me, like, hydration? Oh, cool, 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 cool. How can I figure... <sighs> Raw deer meat. What the hell? How do I fill that back up? Fully hydrated. Right click to drink. Can hold enough water for a day. Okay, so. Ah. So this is important. Can we move this? Yeah, there we go. <laughs> well, that would have been helpful. Wow, I need experience. Bad. So I'm not very rested. I am very hydrated and I need 
no food as of right now. That's gonna be a pain in the ass, because I move all but like two miles an hour. Can we get more water? How do I get more water? Fuck. <laughs> oh god, it's the bush of bullshit! Okay, 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 okay. So... <laughs> Alright guys. What are we gonna do? So, I've been in trouble for nearly robbing people. Wait! Wait, wait, what? How did I enter combat? Who's trying to fight me? Are you trying to fight me? I will fight you, bro. Seriously, though, like, for reals. Like, what was trying to fight me? I'm a little concerned. <laughs> uh, this town is not very safe. Can I repair stuff? No, I need nails. Did I get nails? Wait, what? How do I repair crap? Okay, we need wood and we need a smelter. So I need to gather crap and then- oh, I don't want to go that way. Don't go that way. That's where you died. <laughs> Alright, let's see, let's see, let's see. Can we go this way or are we gonna die here as well? Wait, what? Bartok used melee attack against Forest Spider. What the shit? Why did it start sounding really creepy all of a sudden? Like, I'm kind of scared to go this way. Oh, it's a wolf. Oh, shit! Oh, that's funny. They kind of mimic my stuff. Alright, let's fight. Fine, let's do it. Let's fight. I win? What the fuck is that? What is the creepy, like, shiny, flashy light thing? That, oh god. Yeah, we did it! We almost died. What is it? What is that? What's oh, the thing you can fight? Fuck that. Nope. <laughs> that looks like it would kick our asses. I'm just saying. I don't think that would go well in our favor. What up? You? Bye, friend. Oh, I got something. What do we gotta do? Item list. No, wait. That's not a thing. Wait, what? Wait, what did he just give me? Journal. Oh. Catch a few bees for their apiary. Okay. Uh, I think I got bees from a weird thing. God, I wish I moved faster. This is just sadly slow. Wait, how's our plant doing? How do I get water? That's gonna become a problem. I gotta get somewhere to this somehow. Can I get through here? Or am I just fucked? Oh, can I get through that? Yeah! Ow. Okay. Got fucked up by some bees. This is fine. This is fine. It's part of life. It's part of life. There was another one. Right there. There's another one. Slowberry. I should probably learn some stuff on how to craft these things. Ugh! <laughs> what is 
that? I'm so genuinely curious now. Let's hack our way to everything. Probably gonna get involved in some battle I don't wanna be a part of. Knowing my luck. Poison trap, worn chain gloves, potion of absorbed shadow damage. That sounds pretty dope. Cool. Not what I was expecting. I don't know why some random dude's tomb is like in here. But hey, it's cool. It's what else. Wait, why did my character thing go away again? Stay up there. I need to see you. And we're dehydrated again. How do I get... This game is frustrating. <laughs> if I'm being honest. Like, we can't go through bushes or hack bushes down. I don't really know why we can't hack these bushes down. It seems kind of pointless to not be able to hack a bush down. To be honest with you. I just don't... I don't get it. Has a chance to remove burning effects. I'm just gonna eat it, because I wanna eat it. Beehive honey. Okay. So, I can at least get some hydration from doing a couple things. Oh, I'm sorry. Can you not chop that tree down? Look at my big-ass muscles. Dazzles up. I'm just a bit confused. I think I need to make a door handle for my grandpa. Okay, so I have wood. Oh shit. Okay, I have wood. Boop. Cool, we're making progress. And then I guess I need some iron ore. Ah, oh, that was convenient. Gold ore? Can I smelt both? Nope. Okay, just kidding. <laughs> Stop fucking around with it. Now, does it make all of them at once? Nope. Slow and steady wins the race. We've got silver, gold, and coal. Combinable. I don't know what the hell that means. Oh, does it use two, two ore per thing? Oh, it does. That sucks. Whatever. So, okay... But that one doesn't. Or can you just do two at a time? And that's why. Yeah, so it uses two ore per item. How did we get a ruby? Probably from doing so. If your mining level is not enough for the gold. Okay. Well, fudge me, I guess. Okay, that's a combinable one. Okay, so we're done with that. Bullshit. <laughs> We're gonna... Oh, we can craft a door handle. Good, because I needed that. Create one. Cool, we got one. Nails. Create. Two. Because I can do that. Okay, so we got some nails, and we got a door handle. So, okay. Progress. How do we sleep? <laughs> do we just go up to a bed and hope for the best? To be honest, I don't know. Because our character's stuck. God. How do I, I... Why is it glowing all creepy in there? That looks spooky as heck. Good thing I'm not in there anymore. Ooh. So we're going to gather a bunch of stuff. And then, note to self, if something ever moves in your bag again, it's a fucking... bug that will eat all your inventory up so keep an eye out for that which is kind of funny because it's technically accurate to what could possibly happen in real life uh for some of those things so i can't do that right now what could i not do i'm confused that's fine i'm confused a lot grown corn yay food i still need to know how to get four Wood for pine bubble. Oh. Not enough materials. 
Okay, so I guess that's the whole purpose of that whole thing. Harvest. Because I need food. I think. Okay, how do you water something? I need to know. Requires water bucket. How do I craft a water bucket? I need to know how to craft a water bucket. <laughs> Empty honey jar, coffee, and bread. Cool. Can we... Oh, my own bed. Sleep until morning. <laughs> and now I'm starving. This is great. God, I'm really bad at this game. Eat some food. And I'm not hydrated. Great. Now I have an empty coffee cup for no reason. I'm really well fed, and I'm not hydrated at all. How do I get more water? I feel like that's really important. Uh, nine. How do I get more water? <laughs> Can I get here? Can I get anything here? Oh! I'm fully hydrated. So does that mean my flask is like good? Oh yeah, okay, cool, 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 cool. Cool. Alright. So you guys, we can plant in this game. You can do quite a bit of stuff here. And so that's really awesome. And I think this will be a fun game for if you're really into uh like the crafting style of things. And what where were those things this entire fucking time? There were just nails sitting in here. Well, now you know. If you didn't know, now you know. <laughs> but yeah, so... It looks like you're supposed to help out some people. Probably fix a couple things, at least the house. And kind of go from there. So there is a questing thing as well. So if you press J at your journal, you're going to be able to pull that up. It's got turn-based combat, uh, very MMO feeling, um, MMORPG. So if that's kind of your thing, it looks like this game has quite a bit of all of that. This is just kind of a random Sunday gaming playthrough, so I'm not going to get very far into the game to show you like the story part of it. Um, it's a little bit slower than I was expecting, but if you like that kind of slow and steady feel to it, it kind of gives me that MMORPG, um, but it also gives me a little bit of the uh, Stardew Valley Harvest Moon type vibes with a little bit of the crafting, kind of interacting with people, and also kind of building stuff, farming stuff, things like that. So I think this is going to be one that I'm going to play more of. I don't know how you guys feel about it. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you kind of thought about this. Again, for me, as far as recording purposes, it's a really slow game. So I think I'm going to end here. But as far as actual gameplay, I do think this one is one to keep. So if this is going to be something that interests you guys, I highly recommend it. Otherwise, if you feel like you want to see other games, please let me know. But otherwise, I'll see you guys next time. Bye for now.